Dez improved over the last two seasons. <laughs> yeah, well, I was kid Dez. You know, when, he, when he was a young player, you know, he was a strong safety. We, like, we didn't know if he could maybe play at this level. And he deserves all the credit. You know, he's, he's built himself into a football player mentally and physically. And uh, he and Austin Moore both very cerebral players. And uh, it's, it's spoils you having those kind of guys in the room because then it's like having another coach. You know, because they're constantly talking to the other Sams, the other Wills, when they come off the field, which is huge. Uh, you know. Which guy? Okay. Which guys or guy has kind of made the most or the biggest strides since day one of camp? Uh, well, I don't know. I mean, a guy that jumps out right now is Terry Kirksey. Terry Kirksey has had a, a good fall camp and uh, really encouraged about uh, where he's at. Uh, we have three really capable Mike linebackers in Austin Romaine, Bill Palmer, and, and uh, Terry Kirksey. Um, so that's really encouraging. It gives us some flexibility, potentially, of moving one of those guys, you know, uh, potentially to another linebacker spot. Uh, Asa Newsom has had a good fall camp because he didn't have spring football. Right. And he hasn't played football for a year now because he got hurt back in what, September, maybe. Right. I can't remember when he had the, the surgery. But So, you know, without spring ball, I've been encouraged by Asa's progress. Des is a big help. You know, he's always in Asa's ear talking to him and uh, bringing him along. So Des is helping to flatten that curve. The confidence for Asa since having that, is it starting to come back? I think so. I, mean, I think, you know, those guys with ACLs, it's all about the confidence. And then, you know, as camp wears on, they get a little sore. Um, and some, sometimes they have better days than others. But I think uh, he, he's, he's doing well because his knee brace actually broke. And they had to order him a new one. And so he went a couple of days without that knee brace. And I was like, hey, buddy, <laughs> you doing okay? Uh, yeah, it feels great. So, uh, How frustrating has it been with Marin Coleman not having full go? Mm -hmm. And in addition to that, how much do you think he can eventually help you? Good looking player. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's definitely uh, set him back you know, a little bit developmentally without having him in, in spring football. Um, but he's played a lot of football, and he's a strong, physical young man. And so today was probably his first day of really getting back in there. Um, but I think, you know, Alec is just going to continue to develop over the course of the season, which uh, adds some more depth, which may allow us to, to move some people around. But, uh, yeah, Alec, uh, a smart kid, uh, wants to be out there. And, uh, you know, he was a captain you know, in New Mexico. And so obviously he has, you know, some leadership uh, skills. It's just a matter of assimilating, you know, into our culture. And uh, our guys have been fantastic in, in welcoming him. Uh, we, got a, we got a really good room there in the linebacker.